Hi boys, can you tell us your names and what grade you're in? Sure, my name is Chase McClark and I am in the fifth grade. My name is Logan Bill I'm in the fifth grade. What did you guys do for your science fair project? I took Mentos. Can you tell me what you guys did with the Mentos and the Diet Coke? Put seven Mentos into one bottle at a time. In one bottle. You put seven Mentos in one bottle. So you put Mentos into your bottles with, with the Diet Coke. Mm -hmm. And what happens when you put Mentos into Diet Coke? It makes an explosion. Oh, fun! Whoa! Oh, oh no! Oh, no. Where did you find that idea? On the internet, on a YouTube video. Okay. And when you watched that video, how many pieces of Mentos did they use? Seven Mentos. Seven Mentos. Okay, Logan, when you do an experiment and you want to see if something you change makes a difference, how many things can you change at, at a time? One variable. One variable, that's right. And do you remember what we call that one variable, Mason? Manipulated variable. A manipulated variable, that's right. That's what the scientist is testing. What was your manipulated variable that you decided to change in your experiment? The number of Mentos. The number of Mentos. How many Mentos did you put in your other bottles? 3, 4, 9, 11. 3, 4, 9, and 11. Okay. So, when you were looking at the research, what did you learn about Mentos and Diet Coke? Why do they react and cause an explosion? Because of carbon dioxide. What about carbon dioxide? Let um, Logan talk a little bit, too. The Mentos have the little holes on it. And um, once it reach, once it go down into the bottle um, Diet Coke, it causes a explosion. Okay, so there's there's little little holes or dimples on the Mentos. Okay, and what does the carbon dioxide do to those little pits or holes on the? It Mentos? starts making bubbles that come out of the holes. Okay, the carbon dioxide gas attaches to those bubbles, and as the Mentos goes. Down, um, more bubbles come up. The carbon dioxide gas goes upward. Goes up. And what does it carry with it as the gas goes up? Pop. The pop. Yeah, the Diet Coke. And it causes an explosion. How far up in the air did the pop go? Whoa! Oh, that was a pop! Really far up in the air. Really far? Like taller than you? Taller than me. Taller than your dad? Yeah. Yeah, about 25 feet up into the air, didn't it? Yeah. Yeah. And what kind of materials did you need in order to do your experiment? Five bottles of Diet Coke, five graduate students. Can you look at us, sweetheart? A measuring cup that measures milliliters, three packs of Mentos, pieces of, piece of plywood, large enough to hold five bottles of Diet Coke, and a video camera. Okay, so can you show us the geyser tube, Logan? Where are the geyser tubes? We're going to have the Diet Coke bottles with the empty. Okay. Empty. Okay. And how do those work? By putting mantles in there, then pulling them in, and then get your mantles drop in. Neat. Then the blue, and then all the pop goes out, and there's a little, oh. little hole there. And out it comes. Out okay. it comes. Hi to the air. All right. So, so what problem or question were you then testing if you changed the number of Mentos? Well, changing the number of Mentos made the explosion go higher or lower. Okay. So you wanted to know that the original experiment had seven Mentos, and you wanted to know if you changed that number of Mentos, would it change the effect of the explosion. So what was your hypothesis? What did you think would happen before you did your experiment? The larger the number of Mentos, the larger the explosion. Okay, so you thought that the largest bottle here with 11 Mentos, you thought that would have the largest explosion? Yeah. And which bottle did you think would have the smallest explosion? The, the three Mentos. The bottle. three Mentos, okay. 
And did you have any explanation as to why you thought that might happen? Mm. Repeat the question, please. Why do you think that might have happened? Well, if you have seven Mentos and it caused an explosion this high, and you have less Mentos here and more Mentos over here, what do you think is going to happen to the explosion? Mm. Might be the same height. Oh, different heights. They go go. They go different heights. With the number of Mentos, right? And that's what you thought was going to happen. High or low? Yeah. Did you did you find out in the end that that's what happened? Is that what happened when you when you ran your ran all of your bottles? Okay, three. One, two, three, go. Whee! It seems oh. like it just did the same. Yeah, it was. It's probably going to be too Okay, Lil. Three, two, one, Let's go. Do you think it's bad? Whoa. Whoa. Oh, my God. How many am I, Ethan? Is that 11? So that's the 9. Three, two, one. Blast off. No, 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 no. no. Oh, hey, I missed the sign. Ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Blast off. Oh, no. What did you measure to see whether or not the Mentos caused a difference? 650 milliliters of um, pop. How much pop there was. Okay, so you measured to see how much pop there was left in the bottle. Which one are we doing? The third one? Are we doing... We're doing the three Mentos right now, Logan, yep. That's the one. Um, yep. Is that the, like, Logan's 700? being our recorder. He's taking notes. It's like notes. about the 700. It's about the 700. Okay. Cause it reached it. Just a second. 700. Not reached. quite. Uh, 790. What are you doing, Logan? Um, because the So you're being the. Data recorder? Yeah. Good job. Measuring cup. Measuring cup to see how good it is. Keep going. Let's see if it passes the tunnel loop. Got it all poured in there? Yes. It's like 650. It says 650. It's 650. Okay. And how much pop was left in your bottles? Was there a difference? 700 milliliters of pop. 700 milliliters of pop. 700 milliliters of pop. 650 milliliters of pop. They're left in. They're left in. They're left in. So, pure the same. Three, all the same. So overall, was there a big difference in this experiment? Did the number of Mentos cause a higher or lower explosion, or were they the same? I think they were like the same.